Hello, I'm Jeff Law. I'm the Chief Appraiser of the Tarrant Appraisal District. We recently mailed out appraisal notices to residential property owners and soon we will be mailing commercial notices. The purpose of the notice is to inform you of the market value your property for the 2023 tax year. When it comes to property valuation, there are three types of values. The first is market value. The law defines market value as the price your home would sell for if it were put on the market on January the 1st. The second value is the appraised value. Appraised value and market value can be confusing as some folks use the terms interchangeably. Appraised value is sometimes referred to as the homestead cap value. You're probably aware that the appraised value cannot increase more than 10% from one year to the next. The appraised value is a simple math calculation in which the current year's capped value cannot go up more than 10% over last year's capped value. The third value is known as cap taxable value. This is the value the county, city, and schools will apply their tax rate against to calculate how much property tax you will owe. The taxable value equals the appraised value minus all the exemptions you qualify for. It's been well publicized that the real estate prices have risen dramatically over the past eight years. We and other appraisal districts across the state have had to readjust our appraisals to accurately reflect what homes are actually selling for. The increase in market value has been shocking for all of us and something we haven't seen to this extent in a long time. One of the primary reasons for the rise in sales prices has simply been that demand for homes in North Texas is greater than the supply. You may feel that our value is overstated, and if you do, I would encourage you to review the information we make available on our website. To review that information, you will need to register a new account at tad.org. If you try to use your login from last year, it will not work. For better cybersecurity, a new registration is required. Once you have registered, your online account, you can add your property to your dashboard by clicking the Add Property button. On your appraisal notice, there will be two numbers you will need in order to add a property to the dashboard. One is a unique PIN number in the upper right corner. The other number will be your account number and it's located in the upper left corner. Once you get your account or accounts loaded, you can click on the account number to get more information. Scroll down to the Documents section for information about your property and this year's appraisal. If you still feel your value is incorrect, you have some options. You can either call our office at 817-284-3925, or you can come to our office at 2500 Hanley Eaterville Road and speak informally with one of our appraisers. Before you reach out, you will want to gather some information that could be helpful to us. This would include photographs, repair estimates, recent sales documents, a recent fee appraisal, or a market analysis performed by a local real estate professional. If you choose to proceed directly to a protest, you can do that as well. You can protest your appraisal a couple of different ways. One would be to file a protest by completing the documents on the reverse side of the appraisal notice that we've mailed to you and dropping it in the mail or bringing it to our office. Another way would be to file a protest online. In order to file a protest online, you will need an online account as stated before. Then file the protest through our website. At that time, you will have an option of providing your estimate of market value and uploading supporting documentation. I hope you find this information helpful. We want to make sure that your value is as accurate as we possibly can. And again, state law instructs us to appraise property for property tax purposes at 100% of its market value. I hope you have a blessed day, and if there's anything Tad can do to assist you in this process, please let us know.